Hi and welcome to this 25 minute vinyasa feel alive yoga flow to deepen your connection between a strong body and a balanced mind. So if you are ready, just grab your mat and let's begin together. So we are going to start in the very back of your mat in a sitting position, sit on your heels, straight back, gently close your eyes and take a deep inhale, reach with your arms up, exhale, arms down, inhale, arms reaching up, look up, exhale, arms down. Now take your right hand to your chest, left hand to your belly, close your eyes, and make an intention. What is your goal with this flow, with this practice? What is you gonna let go? What is it what you would like to achieve? You wanna be better in something, change something. Set your intention and take a deep inhale through your nose, fill your lungs with oxygen and exhale through your nose. Deep inhale, chest, ribs, belly, exhale through your nose. One more time, take a deep inhale, fill your lungs with oxygen and gently, slowly, Exhale it out, release your hands, open your eyes, take a deep inhale, reach with your arms up and as you exhale, twist on the left side, so right hand goes on the left knee, look over your left shoulder, inhale, arms reaching up, exhale, other side, left hand, right knee, look over the right shoulder, inhale, come back in the front, arms reaching up, and as you exhale, slowly come down to your child's pose, forehead reaching the mat, come back to your intention, stay grounded, stay in this moment and breathe in and out. Now take a deep inhale through your nose. As you exhale, come on up, on all fours, open gently, hip wide your knees and come on, inhale in your cow and exhale to your cat pose, inhale, arch your back, exhale, round it, look to your belly button, inhale, arch and exhale round round stretch out your calves ease inhale arch exhale now slowly start to walk with your hands in the front of your mat and come on down into your puppy pose reach your forehead to the mat and keep your knees on the mat and the legs are in 90 degrees so your hips are above your knees. Take a deep inhale. And as you exhale, release more down. Maybe you place your chin on the mat. Now take a deep inhale slowly. Come forward into your swing pose. Open your chest, look up. Breathe in and out. Feel the gentle bend on your back. Breathe in, you can close your eyes and as you exhale, place your forehead to the mat. Now grab with your right hand, your right leg, pull your heel towards the glute. Take a deep inhale, lift your chest up, hold, feel the stretch of your right quad, hold and exhale. Relax and release the leg. Now other side, left hand grabs the left leg. Stretch your quad. Inhale, lift up your chest. Push, push, push the heels to the glutes. Hold. 
breathe and exhale release the leg and release your body to the mat now interlace your fingers behind your back lift your chest and hold strong back engage your glutes all the leg is on the mat including the feet then exhale and release back to the mat release the hands place your hands next to your chest tuck your toes and push yourself up and back to downward facing dog bend your knees extend and lengthen your spine you don't need to put your heels yet to the mat it's our first downward facing dog spread your fingers and walk your dog bend your left and right knee push your hips higher and higher and extend your spine look through your belly button or in between your knees and hold the downward facing dog now gently bend your knees extend lengthen the spine feel the release and gently slowly start to walk in the front of your mat inhale halfway lengthen you can reach with your hands to your knees to get a seven shape and exhale fold forward hands on the mat bend your knees inhale arms reaching up look up exhale hands to your heart find your center find your balance in samasthiti hands and arms are next to your body lift your knees lift your toes to find the center and spread them and release take a deep inhale reach with your arms up exhale bend forward inhale half a lift hands on your knees exhale step back to plank and knees chest chin goes down to the mat inhale cobra breathe in and exhale push back to downward facing dog push your heels closer and closer to the mat but if you want to bend your knees that's also very good lengthen the spine that's the point here hold look over your knees spread your fingers and breathe now bend your knees and step in the front of your mat inhale halfway lengthen and exhale fold forward inhale arms reaching up look up and exhale hands to your heart inhale arms reaching up one more round exhale fold forward hands on the mat inhale half a lengthen exhale step back to plank take a vinyasa or knees chest chin down inhale cobra exhale push back to downward facing dog breathe in deeply and out pull the navel to the spine and hold breathe in and gently hop or step in the front of your mat inhale halfway lift exhale fold forward bend your knees inhale arms reaching up look up exhale hands to your heart and down next to you palm facing in the front find your mountain pose inhale arms reaching up chair pose bend your knees hold hold don't forget to breathe and then exhale fold forward hands on the mat inhale halfway lift exhale step back to plank take a deep inhale and as you exhale knees chest chin goes down inhale cobra 
exhale push back to downward facing dog now take a deep inhale lift your right leg up and step between your hands place the left knee down inhale lift your arm up and your torso hold push your hips down feel the stretch place your hands on your knees hold inhale arms reaching up open the chest then exhale hands on the mat tuck your toes step back to plank and take a chaturanga upward facing dog and downward facing dog you can always choose how you want to take your vinyasa now other side left leg goes up step in the front with, with your hands right knee down on the mat inhale arms reaching up knees above the ankle open the chest open the heart and hold then hands on the mat tuck your toes step back to plank knees chest chin goes down inhale upward facing dog lift your thighs lift your legs from the mat and push back to downward facing dog hold three deep inhales and exhales look through your knees spread the fingers lengthen that spine take a deep inhale bend your knees and step in the front of your mat inhale halfway lift exhale fold forward bend your knees inhale arms reaching up chair pose exhale hands to your heart and down find your mountain pose inhale one more time chair pose arms reaching up hold hold strong legs active underbody exhale fold forward inhale halfway lift exhale step back to plank take a deep inhale and as you exhale take a vinyasa bend your elbows upward facing dog open the chest shoulders away from the ears and exhale push back to downward facing dog right leg up step in the front between your hands left knee down arms reaching up push your hips down feel a stretch the opening and hold exhale hands on the mat lift your back knee and take a chaturanga upward facing dog and push back to downward facing dog other side left leg travels up then as you exhale step in the front right knee on the mat inhale arms reaching up hold hold and breathe exhale hands down on the mat step back to plank pose and take a vinyasa upward facing dog hold and as you exhale push back to downward facing dog hold pull the navel to the spine push your heels closer and closer to the mat and breathe take a deep inhale bend your knees and hop in the front of your mat inhale halfway lengthen exhale fold forward inhale bend your knees arms reaching up chair pose exhale hands to your heart and down to mountain pose stay here take a deep inhale continuing arms reaching up exhale fold forward inhale half a lengthen exhale step back to plank pose take a deep inhale and as you exhale take a chaturanga upward facing dog and push back to downward facing dog take a deep inhale right leg reaches up bend your knees open the hips 
keep your shoulders square and try to reach with your heels to your glutes then come back bring your knees to your chest hold hold it strong strong core and step between your hands drop your left knee on the mat inhale reach with your arms up hold it and bring your left knee up from the mat if you can hold high lunge arms reaching up exhale left knee goes back to the mat hands on the mat and open up on the right side so right arm goes up and coming into a twist open your chest open your heart exhale release the right hand back and extend the right leg if you can flex your right feet and feel the stretch of your hamstring hold come up to your fingertip if it helps stretch out that leg take a deep inhale and as you exhale come on in the front bend the knee again look up then exhale, extend the right knee. Inhale and exhale. Feel the stretch, feel the lengthening. Try to reach with your forehead closer to your knee. Take a deep inhale, bend your right knee, come on in the front to low lunge. Lift your knee, step back to plank and take a chaturanga upward facing dog then push back to downward facing dog we are going to repeat the same thing on the other side so left leg travels up bend your knee and try to reach with your heels your glutes open the hips keep your shoulders square then inhale bring your knee to your chest hold hold strong core and step between your hands drop the right, right knee and come on up with your arms hold low lunge supported low lunge now inhale lift your left knee from the mat high lunge hold it strong lower body now drop the right knee back to the mat right hand on the mat and left arm going up open into your twist look up to the sky if you can and if your neck allows open your chest exhale release the hand to the mat and extend the left knee just like before if you can flex your feet Take a deep inhale and with every exhale try to go deeper and deeper inhale bend your left knee come in the front exhale extend it back feel the stretch of the hamstring the point is not to round the back too much is more keeping a straight back inhale come on in the front again tuck your toes step back to plank and take a vinyasa upward facing dog then push back into downward facing dog with the release of the body with the difference how does the down dog feels now and how did it feel before if your hamstrings are more loose take a deep inhale bend your knees and hop in the front and find yourself in a seated position into Navasana so lift your feet arms are straight bend the knees hold now slowly start to touch with your left feet the mat right feet more like your toes right toe left toe strong core right left right left toe 
and bow toes up and down up and down little core exercise here up and down up and down keep on keep on doing up and down up and down bring your knees to your chest give yourself a big hug forehead to the knee and slowly release gently come down to the mat bring your knees to your chest close your eyes and feel as your heartbeat starting to release now cross the right leg above the left and drop it on the left side so we are going into a side twist look over your right shoulder arms are straight feel the lengthening feel the stretching hold this twist breathe try to keep your shoulders on the mat or as close as possible just breathe Take a deep inhale, bring your knees to your chest and change. Left knee goes over right and drop it on the right side and look over on the left side. Feel the gentle release of this wonderful stretch. Close your eyes. Breathe and relax. Breathe in, bring your knees back and give yourself a big hug. You can lift your chest up, reach with your forehead to your knees. Now grab the outer edge of your feet and come into your happy baby pose. You can bring in some movement if it feels good for your body, left and right, or choose stillness whatever it feels good for you at this moment release bring your forehead to the knees and come on down into our final pose shavasana release your feet release your legs release your chest release your face Relax your shoulders, your arms, relax your fingers, only your chest is moving up and down as you're breathing and your heart, listen to your heartbeat and just relax your mind, come back to your intention. feel your whole body is relaxing now take a deep inhale reach with your arms up take a big big stretch bend both of your knees feet on the mat and slowly turn in one of your sides and gently come on up into your seated position keep your eyes closed if you can Take a deep inhale, reach with your arms high up, look up, exhale, hands in Anjali Mudra to your heart, bend and bow in front of you. Thank you and yourself for this beautiful practice that you dedicated this time to yourself and to your body, to your health. Have a lovely day. Namaste.